Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial on motion graphics. It's Nadia here from Blue Sky Graphics. And today I would like to show you how to animate the blur by word effect from the effects and presets panel using text. Let's begin. So I'll begin by creating a new composition. I do this by clicking on new composition. I have a HDTV 29 frames per second, 10 seconds length for my composition, and I have a bright yellow black background. I then want to create a text. So I select the text tool from the toolbar and begin typing my desired text. I will type blue sky graphics, but feel free to type anything you like. I then select the selection tool and position my text where I want the final animation to appear. I then make sure the time indicator is at the beginning of time, as this is where I want the effect animation keyframes to be added. I then head over to the effects and presets panel and type in blur by word. I left click on the effect, hold and drag and drop on top of my text like so. The effect has been added to the text layer. I select the text layer and click U, the shortcut to view all keyframes and adjust if necessary. I then preview the animation by clicking the space bar on the keyboard. To smooth the animation, I select the keyframes, right click on the mouse, keyframe assistance, and easy ease. Furthermore, I can select the keyframes and click on the graph editor to further smooth the animation. But feel free to have some fun here adjusting the animation. I am now happy with how it looks. Next, I want to create an exit animation. So I'll move the time indicator in time. Select the keyframes, go to edit, copy, then edit and paste. I finally want to revert the last two keyframes, so I have an exit animation. I select the keyframes, right click on the mouse, keyframe assistance, and time reverse keyframes. Hit the space bar to preview it. And there we have it guys, a text animation using the blur by word effect from the effects and presets panel. Feel free to play around with this effect and don't forget to have fun. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out. See you in the next tutorial.